Thank you. I'll try to wrap this up. Um, so much has been said. And let me try to summarize briefly. The Biden administration has an energy policy that's bad for American jobs, bad for the American economy, bad for national security, as it makes us more dependent on foreign sources of energy once again, as well as our allies, more dependent on foreign sources of energy. And it's bad for the environment and bad for the climate because, of course, those foreign sources of energy are not as clean as ours. Just to give you a, uh, some specifics, natural gas produced in Russia and sent by pipeline to other parts of, of um, Europe or, or to, to Asian countries basically emits about 50 percent more greenhouse gas emissions than natural gas produced in the United States and shipped. So it's bad for jobs in the economy in the United States. It's bad for... It's bad for national security, and it's bad for the climate. Other than that, it's a hell of a good idea. <laughs> I, I mean, you, you, so I think someone was being kind. I think it was Dan when he, he said that, that the Biden administration has a lot of smart people. I'm not sure. I'd prefer that they be ignorant than be evil. But they do need to be accountable for what's happening. And here's the really sad part in the United States. As a couple of weeks ago, a few weeks ago, the, the energy secretary said, um, in, in response to a question from, from one of your colleagues, that uh, presidents don't set gas prices, markets do. But policy determines market reaction. Every bad policy has a negative reaction in the marketplace. Shrinking of, of supply while growing demand with an influx of a whole bunch of free money creates inflation. But I think the worst part about, about inflation energy inflation is that on top of all the other inflation, which comes naturally with the same market forces, energy inflation raises the price of everything. Everything that we grow, everything we produce, everything we manufacture, everything that we ship, whether we ship it in or we ship it out. We have a better plan. Um, Senator Sullivan mentioned that we're going to be outlining some things going forward. I think it's important to have solutions to the problems, but right now the problem's obvious. And that is the deliberative, deliberate policies of the Biden administration in an effort, evidently, to transfer their climate guilt to polluters. 